Hey, what's up, it's CJ here, and today we're gonna to dive into DaVinci Resolve. We're gonna talk about how to cut clips or how to add clips to the timeline. This is something that kind of you know, frustrated me at first. I actually did a project and, and I did the entire project without knowing this, uh, but I'm actually glad that I know it now. So let's just dive in and let's, let's get to it. So basically when you are, um, when you're about to edit and you're viewing your project, uh, there's a couple of things that you should kind of know when trying to start to edit. We are in the edit tab here and uh, we are, we have our B-roll up. We have just a collection or a bin of content here that we can kind of choose and pick from. And as you can see, we have two windows or displays up. Um, this is basically two different viewers. One viewer is for what's on the timeline and the other viewer it's for, is for what's in your bins or in your media uh, pool. So let's go ahead and look at one of the videos from our media pool. And the way we can pull that up is actually just double click on it. And now it'll pop up in the pre preview or player. One of the things that I was fl fl uh, frustrated with was that over here, here's, here's one thing you can uh, pick up really quick is this little slider will actually change the way or the size of your thumbnails. And you can also change the way the thumbnails look by just toggling through these different options. I like to keep it here, but you can make it as big as you want to. So one of the things I was getting frustrated with was that I wasn't able to actually take the clips and just put the portion of the clips that I wanted to. So coming from you know, Final Cut Pro, you can kind of like drag over here and drag over here and kind of select the part of the clip that you want and just drag it down. Here, you just kind of pull the whole clip down. And that's not what I really wanted to do. Uh, and that's one way of adding it. But as you can see, the entire clip is down here. And if I was editing multiple portions or multiple parts together, um, Let's say I wanted to just put something right in between here. If I was to drag this down here, I can't really do that. I have to drag it down and then trim it to fit within the part that I want to, which kind of just, it just took too long for me. Another thing that I was kind of frustrated at was that, um, you know, if I was to bring this down here and try to fit it in here, what it will do is cut away from what I already have in here. So didn't really like that. But I'm just gonna show you how to add these clips, you know, without dragging the entire clip down. Um, so that's one way to add it, is just drag the entire clip down. The other way we can do this is we actually just double click on this and make sure it's up in our viewer. And there's a little timeline here where we can actually scrub through and look at this clip and see which part we like the most. And what we can also do is once we find that part, we actually make a selection here by pressing mark in. So mark in lets you know, like this is the part that you wanna start. And then you can play it into or scrub it till you get to a part where you want to end the clip and then you can mark out. So that's your mark in and mark out. And now what you can do is just drag this clip down to the timeline and you now have a clip that is just the portion that you want pulled down to the timeline. So that was really a struggle for me trying to edit an entire video without knowing that. But now that I know that, it's you know it's a lot simpler to get what I need into the timeline. And also, let's say you do want another clip from this portion, you can just find the next clip. Press mark in and it will readjust and then press mark out. And then all you have to do is drag that portion down. That's it. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.